And when the sun goes up. This is how I made thing mouse cursor to match this custom Wednesday wallpaper and icon pack. And I guarantee you by the end of this video, you will learn how to create yours. Apps you will need. You will need three apps. A drawing software, I mainly use Adobe Photoshop, Real World Cursor Editor to fix hotspot issues, and save images to a compatible format, and Custom Cursor to easily switch mouse pointers. Download link is seen in the description. Most of us have an attention span like that of Andrew Tate's hair span. So don't worry, downloading and installing apps will only take a few minutes. Drawing your mouse cursor. I've made a Wednesday mouse cursor set before, but the hotspot issues makes it really hard to click things accurately. It's supposed to click the search bar above, not the bookmarks bar. You know what? I'll shove this up my ass. Let's make a new set. Canvas size. The maximum compatible size is 256 by 256 pixels. And of course, at least 300 dpi. The thing is, the size is pretty small for an artwork. But I mean, for us Asians, it still works. Am I right? Hey, yep. <laughs> Point is, don't worry if it looks kinda blurred. I was thinking of doing this scene, but this channel does not condone that type of behavior. So I am making the classic pointing, no speaking, or rectal examining pose. This way, the direction would be similar to the normal arrow we're used to. You'll probably wanna know the different types of cursors and what they're for. So let's get it on. Arrow pointer, the most basic cursor, link pointer. It tells you that the link will redirect you to another website once you click. Text pointer, it shows up when you edit a text. Help pointer, it is used to provide helpful information about the program. Background busy pointer, this only lets you know that an app is running in the background but you can still do other tasks. Busy pointer, shows up when waiting for a window to become responsive. Precision select, used for graphic and other two-dimensional interaction. Pencil cursor, it usually appears when you activate the pencil tool in some drawing softwares. An available pointer. It shows that a resource is not currently available. Object resizing cursor. It indicates that you can resize an object by dragging it. Move cursor. It moves a selected object by clicking and dragging. And I don't know what this is. Alright, I'm done with the thing, arrow pointer. Let me give you a kiss. Time to save. <laughs> Always choose PNG when saving the file. If you use other format, it will create a white background. You don't want to have that white stuff stuck on your little mouse, ah. do ya? And here's for the other types as well. <laughs> Ooh, fancy. Now it's time to turn this into compatible cur file. Open up real world cursor editor. Make sure to change the canvas size to 256 right here, then click new mouse cursor. Don't be freaking overwhelmed by its interface. This is really easy to navigate. Go to formats, just check this to make sure you are using 256 by 256 canvas. All right, drag the PNG file into the canvas. Adjust it a little bit at the center. You can also resize the image by using this select tool. Just select the whole image then drag the corners to change the size. Then on the left side panel, you can see an area with a cross in the middle. The center is the clicking hotspot. And I'm talking about the G. Drag the image until the thing's finger is placed in the middle. And below you can test the accuracy. Just try and write anything you want. If you think that's Gucci enough, click save as. Select the file type static cursor file, which is a curve file to make it compatible. It just occurred to me. You can also save an animated mouse cursor, but that's for another video. Yeah, don't forget to do the same thing to all the other mouse pointer types, but with more intensity. Oh, look at my babies. Ooh. Easily swap mouse cursor. Time to apply it on the mouse. Oh, my neck. Open up the custom cursor app. Click Upload Cursors, then add your curve files by clicking the plus sign. Name the set and then click Save. Go to the home page, and as you can see, here's the set we have uploaded. Click Apply, and there you go, my boy. You can also change the size by going to the settings. Nice. We've made a custom icon pack. You can do all those steps or you can just download the wallpaper, the mouse pack, icon pack on my shop. Link in the description again. But wait, we're not done yet. Don't leave, my bro. Don't leave. You're probably annoyed by my voice right now. So I will shut up and enjoy this Wednesday wallpaper.
if you flaunt this wallpaper and house cursor to your neighbor, I guarantee you, you can finally say this line to them. I can eat Girl Scouts for breakfast. It is your responsibility to click the like button and to spam the subscribe button. See you, and until next time, I follow broccoli and broccoli lilies. <laughs>